calm before the storm. So, as you know, I've done a couple of little videos out here, um, and I was I've always used this sort of as a, as a workshop, and I have just sort of decided to buy the bullet and get this converted and use it properly. So this is this is going to be the last day that we're going to see it like this. Um, as you can see, there's where I do a wee bit of work. And uh, yeah, so the hard stuff's already been done, really. Um, the power and network inside of things is already done. I already have my own separate power in here, which is good. And I have my own network cable and all done out here, which is handy because with what I, the things that I run on my network and things I got there, can't be doing my wireless. So. Although, I already have wireless. So, uh, yeah, so I've already got hardwired cabling coming out from the house into here. So, those those sorts of things are done, um, which is things I don't really need to worry about. So, it's really just going to be a case of, um, I'm going to start off the back part here, which will then leave me some storage space with the roller door and then we're going to seal that off and um, we're going to insulate everything in here and then we're going to make some other little aesthetic changes in here we're going to put a, a nice floor in because in here is all concrete it's cold and the good thing about it is you'll see over there is the boiler for our oil for our oil heat um, so it will, it's going to get moved out of here, um, but as you can see, we are plumbed for heating. There's already a radiator in here, so that's going to get moved down, which should keep us toasty, toasty warm. So yeah, so I'm excited, I'm excited to get this done, get it the way I want it and have a proper place to work. Not only from my day, you know, my day job, um, working from home and things like that there, if and when it calls for it, but the having a place to properly shoot videos and do unboxings for you guys, you know, is uh, badly needed. So, yeah, definitely. And I have all my office furniture already as well. I had a trip to Ikea a long time ago and it's just been sitting out here so um, it'll be good to see that all built up and ready as well and then this Ooh, that was loud what do you think of this guys that is my desk frame I um when the first lockdown happened, I was looking for desks. Couldn't really find something that I liked and the things that I did like. Due to the demand, the prices were through the roof. And I thought I sort of thought to myself, you know, I don't want to didn't want to buy something and just make do with it. So I have uh, some friends who work. In... So I have some friends that work in the. <laughs> steelwork industry, let's say, um, who made me this frame. And while while I was still uh, working in the house, I was under the mindset of I was going to move this into the house and I was going to set my desk up on it. But due to the sheer weight of this thing, I'm not lifting that under the house. <laughs> no way. No way, Jose. So... Uh, so yeah, so it's staying out here. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna get a nice, uh, a nice top for it, and uh, you know, get it all set up. You know, once we're ready. But yeah, it's pretty funky, isn't it? So, sort of, they built it to the sort of standards that I wanted. So as you can see here, I got them to make me a nice uh, cable tray and things I got there. You know, just to hide my cables and that sort of thing. So I'm really chuffed with it, to be honest. 
and uh, I got them to make me a identical version, only smaller, to have for we have a big color laser printer. So I uh, I got an identical one made for it too. So it'll it'll come out and join it once we're we're ready to roll. So yeah, so this will be this is day one. Or sorry, the final day of in here, the way it is. So I'm excited. I'm excited to get things kicked off. So work is underway. What do you think? Do you, know when you, do, do you ever get to a point where you're doing work, right? And things start coming apart. And then you instantly go, what have I done? Oh no, what have I done? Well, I'm not doing it to be fair, so. <laughs> but yeah. So here we go. So this here is going to come out. This here is all getting cut out. And this is what's going in. Got a nice big PVC window, which is pretty good. And then got a new door put on here. And then look, there's all my insulation going in. So yeah, pretty exciting. So yeah, it's going to come together nicely, I think. Yep. What do you think, Bear? What do you think? You supervising? Yeah, you're a good boy. So, so far so good, day one. So, day one, over. We have a nice new window and a nicely insulated wall. And more insulation here, so good progress so far. Although, look at all this. Uh, but we're getting there slowly but surely. Great, great first day. So, tomorrow we are. Uh, we're gonna get this moved and then this is our sort of marker for where our stud wall goes up so our stud wall sort of is going to go up in line with this and uh yeah so that's day one done and dusted well day two and uh, as you can see, we have a wall. Yeah. Some jab. These these boys don't mess about. Look at this. We are in tip top shape. It is are all moved. It's lovely and warm in here now. And there's my stud wall up. A nice big window. So only my door left to go now, and then some more panels, and then my ceiling to be insulated, and then we're done. So yeah, it's really went together really quick. So it's pretty good. So, what do you guys think? So far, so good. Day two. I couldn't do it. I couldn't do it in all the days of the month. Fair play. Fair play. Here we go. So, just putting in a bit of network cabling. People always say to me, you know, do you really need network cabling for your garage when you've got Wi Fi? Yes, you do. When you're streaming, you're gaming, downloading, any of that, if in doubt, cable up. 
So, yeah. So just run on a nice wee bit of trunk on there. Up to the network point, which is here. And then I'm gonna I'm gonna mount a cabinet here. You know, whichever one's gonna go into. So, big a job. So yeah, we're uh, we're coming along nicely. And it is toasty warm in here now. No more sitting out here, <laughs> freezing. So, good job, good job. And there we go. There are network cables, HDMI's, all loading up to my network points. So, yep, we're in good shape. Good shape. And there, be some job. Can't wait to get in and get all set up. So, get there. Now we have a bit more progress done. We have our roof insulation in, which is pretty awesome. So yeah, things are coming together really nicely. And look, I have a new door. <laughs> Even got a letterbox. How awesome is that? So, yeah, I got proper double glazed PVC door. Help keep the heat in, which is good. So yeah, um, it's coming together pretty nicely. What are you ragging? Not a bad wee bit of workspace now. Well chuffed. Really chuffed. So just a couple of wee final bits to get finished off and then yeah we'll get it painted and we'll go from there. So pretty excited. Pretty excited to get it finished and get properly working out here. So have our next wee bit of progression. Um, as you see there, I've have all my network cabling and video feeds and whatnot going through. But broke my, broke my panel. Uh, hand fisted or what? So um, <clears throat> it's alright though. There's gonna be a TV there, so I'm gonna see it. Um, no, I'll be I'll be getting painted and all anyway. So. But uh, yeah, so next step is have some joists been put in, marked out here. So I'm gonna gonna mount a big screen here, and uh, yeah, let's get to it. So after a lot of Screaming and shouting and banging and getting on. Finally having TV up. So, happy days. And, uh, got my desk set up. Well, not quite set up per se, but it's, uh, just lining up the bit of work top there so I can just screw it down. So I'm really really happy with the finish of it. So nice little bit of work top from IKEA. So uh, yeah, get that screwed up and then we're another step closer. So we're getting there slowly but surely. We're getting there. Another day, another progress update. So uh, sort of into late last night I managed to get that installed so nice little cabinet from Ikea so that's where I'm sort of gonna put all my networking bits and bobs and whatnot and now that I have a desk set up I have just set up my triple monitor bracket with my three 24 inch Ayamas. So 
Yes. Starting to take shape nicely. I think I'll have a wee bit of a gap, so I'll need to do a wee bit more adjusting just to get it going. But yeah, another another little bit of progress. So we're getting there slowly but surely. Um, these lockdown restrictions, you know, we're just killing every little bit of progress that I'm getting. It's sort of, I feel like I got a, a one step forward and now it's two back, you know, but fingers crossed we'll get everything else completed shortly and then uh, I'll be able to work out here full time then, properly. So, but in the meantime, I'm just sort of out here and doing a wee bit of preliminary setup and things like that there, you know, so. Um, plan to get the new floor in and uh, sort of towards the end of January so I'd like to have sort of everything up and running in a way that I would like before the floor goes in you know so get rid of that old cold stone floor try and get rid of some of the dust in here because the dust in here is absolutely awful uh, we're getting there slow and sure wins the race as they say now we have all the trunk in. Um, we're going to do a wee bit of cable running and a bit of terminating. So, yep, next step, baby. Hopefully, by the end of today, I should have up in here semi functional so that I can actually do a bit of work out here. So, yeah, let's get to it. So, that's my trunk in. So, I have what's going to be my sort of so-called comms cab here and then I have my trunking which my cabling's all going to run down through to here to my power source and then trunking along here which will then go into my desk so it's coming together nicely thankfully so now for a bit of Network traveling and uh, terminating. Fun. My favourite thing. So, another day, another progress update. Finally, look at this paint. I thought this day would never come. So. Ta-da! We're getting there. Not to mention, look. I got my new floor today. Totally transforms the place. Buzzing. Absolutely buzzing. I'm getting there. I'm finally going to have a good proper workspace now. The way I want it. So, it's been a long time coming, but we're, we're getting there. We're getting there. Not bad for a first coat of paint. Not bad. What do you think of the colour? I think the floor goes well too. Oh, I dropped it. So, a wee bit of skirting just left to go on and um, I have a bit of panel and still to finish, but that's because the boiler's still in here. So, once the boiler gets relocated, which is the next thing, then uh, it can go outside and then I can get that finished and then there's a bit of floor that still needs to be finished in that corner which is just covered up at the minute which is uh, which I'll get done and then that's it so exciting exciting that just about sort of wraps it up guys like I say I've uh, I've everything sort of in a a a sort of functional state now and apart from a few little cosmetic things to do um, I'm pretty happy with how everyone's turned out if I'm being honest so uh, yeah happy day so I'll sort of show you there's my uh, setup here so as you can see I'm doing a bit of editing so uh, a bit, bit of background noise going on so uh, a bit of, bit of dark night So um, that's a bit of old furniture which will be getting replaced at some stage 
uh, to house my tower. Uh, and then I'm sure you'll see the silver thing in behind my screen. That's my laptop. And then it's docked into a wee docking station here. Um, and then both of them are hooked up so I can just flick the modes on the monitors and then I can I can get in, you know, so so yeah, so Not bad, not bad So I've still got the sort of fluorescent lights in here, which I will get swapped out for LEDs at some stage, but Tell you what I do have Ooh. It's nice in here So I'm sure you recall my Philips Hue video. There's my dimmer switch. Let there be light. It's not bad. It actually gives a, a pretty a pretty nice light in here, you know, to sort of work in, which is which is nice. Um so but they're not staying up there obviously. I just have them up there just at the moment, just as somewhere to put them for now. But um yeah, they're probably gonna get repositioned somewhere in behind the screens or something like that there. And then uh, I'm probably going to get some more um, just to add to it, you know, so, so yeah. But so far, so far so good. Pretty much my, my setup, my secret lab chair, my workspace, Batman, that's not the love. And then I have my sort of review area at the moment where uh, it's, again, something I've just made out of nothing. Um, uh, just to sort of keep me ticking until I get something better. And then a uh, nice big comfy chair, which Bear likes to lie on, you know, so. So yeah, that's that's really it. So hope you liked the video, guys. Um, hit that like button, smash it. Really helps me out in the channel. I just want to say a big thank you to everybody who has followed and subscribed to the channel. Um, I recently hit uh, 100 subscribers. Um, which is, I'm buzzing, I'm over the moon. Um, I, I can't believe I've actually got the, that many people that are interested in listening to what I want to say. So uh, for all you guys, a massive thank you. Um, I really, really appreciate it. And um, for all you newcomers, if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button and uh, I'll catch you guys in the next one. And now I'm going to get back to work. See you later.